Okay, so this white man, he comes across this lamp, right? As he rubs the lamp, a genie appears. And the genie's like, I am the genie of the lamp. I shall grant you three wishes. So the white guy's like, okay, I want to never have to work another day in my life. I want to be able to get any woman I want. And I want to stay hard all night long. So the genie turned him into a nigga. You see that dumb look on my face? Yeah, this one. Little does he know, I've been patiently waiting for this moment. See, in every black and white relationship, there's an unspoken code, a thin line between love or hate. And it's only a matter of time before you get put in that position. After a lifetime of friendship, this white boy then decided to cross the line, test the limits, push the boundaries, position himself, come over to the other side. On one hand, I could let this slide, laugh it off as another knee slapper, another racial remark. But in doing so, setting myself up for a lifetime of black jokes and my nigga comments. Or on the other hand. That's like a compliment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like a compliment. Yeah. Genie. <laughs> you idiot.